Hello folks and welcome, hey, to, welcome today's to today's vlog. We have a day of running errands today and we're having to bring Andy with us because obviously it's a school holidays. Normally we'd come out and do our errands by ourselves but it gets him out the house. It means I don't have to do them on my own. Errand number one, we've started as far away from the house as we need to be and we're slowly working back including the rewards as we go. Errand number one was a trip to the P.O. Box. There are some very unusually shaped things from the P.O. Box this week which we will open when we get home. That's the final errand of the day. Errand number two has basically become bringing Andy from McDonald's because that's how we've got him out. We've had to promise him a McDonald's and a church. We also need to head to the <laughs> pharmacy to get him his medication which he's just about run out of and I'm sure there's another thing as well but like, what was the other thing? Anna doesn't remember either. We should probably start making lists. McDonald's trip complete and we've made the executive decision that Andy is dropping back down to two burger buns again rather than the three he's been on for a little while because for the second time in a row, is it? He's not managed to finish him, he's just kind of the third one, he's just scrunching up with his hands. We don't want him to get to the point where he's becoming intimidated by them and it starts to cause issues. So down to two next time. Next stop, I think there's a church nearby that he's not been to before. So although long-term viewers of the vlog would have seen this particular church two or three times before, probably on the channel, Andy has never been here before. So we're going to watch him experience a brand new church for the first time. Does Mummy have to open it? Are the ropes good? The ropes are visible. This could be problematic. He's trying to get up there. Go home now. It also helps that this is a Pokemon gym, so we've just been able to take the gym while Andy had a wander around out here. And now he wants to go back in for a second look. Everybody wins. We've still not actually managed to get Andy back into Pokemon. But he's starting to show a little bit more interest. Mainly because it often means we get to come to churches. Oh, there's a step. Anna, you're not allowed in here. I, I, listen, can you hear the bell? Do not touch. Did he just manage to grab? Very good. Oh, How? To the bell. It says do not touch. How did he manage to get up there? There's a bell there. Back home, no. you're not supposed to touch. I don't even know which one he grabbed. Oh, that one. Yeah. Right, come on Andy, we need to go home now. No, come on. Well, that's... That's this church off the list of places we can ever come again. No ropes. Shh. It's about to shh. There you go, in that way now. <laughs> Is it finished? It's time to go home. Shh. Shh. It's about to. He's waiting shh. for you to open the door. So yeah, they had a, I think I caught it on camera, uh, one loose bell pulling thing, rope, that's the word I'm looking for, that wasn't with the big collection in the middle, bit massively labelled do not touch, so of course, Andy, joink, and presumably you could hear that outside and stuff, we've probably just really confused the locals, but we just won't come back to this one, now we know there's a bell he can reach and ring, we won't come here again. All errands complete then. 
We are going to open all the PO box stuff in a second, but before we do that, I have a parcel from QWERTY, and I think this is the first parcel that you lot have had something to do with, Haribo's, because the way the affiliate program with QWERTY works, which I am a part of, every time one of you buys a QWERTY shirt using the link that I've got down in the description, I then get a a code that can be used for a random QWERTY shirt whenever I buy another one. So one of these is one that I've bought, and one of them is a random one that I've only got as a result of one of you buying a shirt through my link. So it's not like a traditional affiliate program that's making me money, but it will be interesting to see what the random shirt is. So the one that I've bought, which is awesome, is this one. Mario Theft Auto, there you go Anna, look at that. Grand Theft Auto, Mario style. So the random one that they've sent, which is actually quite cool, bearing in mind they've got Star Trek and all sorts on there. Um, they've sent me Link playing on an NES cartridge, which is also very cool. So thank you to whoever bought a Quake shirt using my link, thus allowing me to get that shirt for free. Star Mix. Anna's arrived and she's come with PO Box stuff. Um, so this, I don't know what this is, <laughs> this is like a proper label, not on the high street in a do not bend thing. Looks like a letter, is this going to be a cease and desist? We stole an idea from not on the high street. Oh! <laughs> That's so cool! Don't know if you can see that. It's the Chapmans and it has our names on them. Peas in a pod and now we have a letter. Peas in a pod, personalised family print, it's actually just the receipt. Oh. Thank you. That's really cool. That's really cool. Let's get a frame. Yeah, I like that a lot. And Dave's on there too. He is. <laughs> Thank Aww. you very much. Thank you. Next. This is oh, heavy. Andy. Um, this is for Andy. So let's see what has been purchased for Andy. Isn't it that email? Oh, of course. No, yeah. we've already got that one. Someone said about this, about how this is the exact same book that we got sent the other day. They yeah, ended up being sent too, so we need to return that one. Yeah, so, no, um, that one's... if you're the person, Andy, just wait, there's still more things to open. And um, if you're the person who contacted us about that, mm -hmm. now we can do, now we can get sorted on getting it sent back. Um, this one is also for Andy. Hope you like your gift. Happy birthday, Andy, from Imogen, Faith, and Jonah, brackets, Mummy of Two, on YouTube. Aww. And it is a oh, Minions no. light projector. There you go. For your bedroom? No. It says Kevin on it, so it must be good. Done. Anything that says Kevin on it must be good. <laughs> Next. The last, the final I think this is the last, isn't it? I think so. This is a... Uh, this is a very strange shaped thing. I think this is two things. Thanks! Mummy up to a YouTube. I guess. Have a look. Planet with the Apes figures. <laughs> Someone did say that they had These they found toys in their loft that they've sent through to us. Yeah. So Planet of the Apes stuff. Anna is a big Planet of the Apes fan, so she's almost certainly claiming them. I can see she's claiming them by the way she's looking at them. Um, and then this. I can't get into it. It's a Funko Pop, but I cannot get into it. Aha, and here's a note of some kind, it seems. Note. Hi Kev, hope you and your family are well. I've recently got my first house from my partner, and as we're clearing out the loft, we found these toys. My girlfriend was about to throw them away, but I thought you'd put them to better use. <laughs> There's two parcels, I couldn't fit them all in one, and I hope you like them, or if not, Andy will find a use for them. Also, I've thanked you on stream already. would like to thank you again for helping me get a local club link for my Football Manager channel. I showed them all the work you did at Nini, Nini and then they loved the idea. That's <laughs> awesome. I know this is on paper, but here's the link for my YouTube channel. I would love you to check it out if you ever have the time. From JC. Um, you should all go and check out that channel because he sent me toys. That's the way, that's the route to my heart. And he sent Batman off of Batman Arkham Asylum along with the Planet of the Apes stuff. Oh. Thank you very much. Very cool. Thank you. And for about the fourth time in the last couple of weeks, I'm finishing a vlog after having finished a stream on Twitch. For those of you who do watch my Twitch streams regularly, this is one of the reasons. 
why I'm uh, abandoning my Twitch streaming schedule for a little while. I think, I've, I think I've got myself in another one of those situations where I've bitten off a little bit more than I can chew with two full-time YouTube channels, a regular Twitch streaming schedule, a regular You Now treat streaming schedule, plus the school summer holidays and all the stuff we need to be getting up to with the kids. So for August, probably only August, I'm abandoning the Twitch streaming schedule and the YouNow streaming schedule, although I anticipate probably continuing to stream on YouNow more regularly on Twitch throughout August because it's less time consuming. It's a half hour thing rather than a two hour thing, but it's not gonna be any kind of schedule. It's kind of just gonna happen when I've got the opportunity to do it rather than feeling like I have to do it certain days at certain times. Uh, the best way to find out as and when I'm going to be streaming is just to follow me on Twitter. I'm Lelujo on Twitter. I'll always let you know at least a couple of hours before I'm going to be streaming. I'll try and make use of the community page here as well if it's going to be a you now stream and you want to be a part of it. But really, as with any content that we create, really, the easiest way to make sure that you don't miss out on any of it is make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on because certainly for the you now stuff that dual streams here on youtube and when i go live on you now if you've got notifications on, on youtube you'll get a notification from both you now and youtube if you subscribe to both of them so that's the easiest way to make sure you don't miss out if you're not able to make an appointment of doing it mondays thursdays and sundays like we were previously I imagine I'll stick fairly loosely to that anyway. Maybe even stream on you now a little bit more often because like I say, it's a half hour thing at a time when Anna's putting Andy to bed and I'm having that cup of coffee anyway. I might as well chat to you lot while I do it. Dave is being mental. But I am gonna leave things there today after a little, after a, just a little bit of secret end of the vlog. Though. Such a loud dog, he has no respect for the camera being on. Um, hopefully you have enjoyed today's vlog. If you have, please make sure you leave a nice big thumbs up on there for us. Subscribe to the channel for more daily vlogs, including tomorrow. I'm back at the chiropractor. Hopefully for the last time, I'm hopefully, hopefully they're gonna tell me my back is fully recovered and they can finally do the adjustment to the pelvis that they've been promising me, which should stop it recurring, in theory. I'm a little bit afraid. And thank you very much for watching.